SENIOR PRANK WILL COST STUDENTS AT A CINCINNATI HIGH SCHOOL THEIR PROM. SOME PARENTS ARE ANGRY THAT THE BIG DANCE WAS AXED AFTER THE STUDENTS STAGED A WATER BALLOON FIGHT. BUT NINE ON YOUR SIDE REPORTER SCOTT WEGENER TELLS US THE CLASS IS ACCEPTING RESPONSIBILITY. MANY SENIORS AT WITHROW UNIVERSITY HIGH SCHOOL ADMIT IT SOUNDED LIKE A GOOD IDEA AT THE TIME. I WAS LIKE, THIS IS GOING TO BE SO FUN. LET'S DO IT, COME ON. A SENIOR PRANK, HAVING A WATER BALLOON FIGHT IN THE SCHOOL'S LUNCHROOM. ANDRE DAVENPORT HAD PLANNED TO STOCK UP ON AMMUNITION. A WHOLE LOT. Trump fool. WHEN THE PRINCIPAL, SHARON JOHNSON, FOUND OUT WHAT THE KIDS HAD PLANNED, SHE IMMEDIATELY GOT ON THE PA. AND ASKED THEM RESPECTFULLY NOT to do that. She asked them again and again and warned them she would cancel their prom if the prank went forward. Then came zero hour. Water balloons were flying everywhere. Good to her word, this letter went out Thursday telling parents prom had been torpedoed. It was very um, painful for the administration to make a decision to tell them that the prom will be canceled. It's a little bit extreme. Parent Kenya Stewart says while the students should be punished, deleting the dance is the wrong way to go. We just want our children to have a prom. So it's three or, three or four parents working together and we're going to try to get it done. While some parents are scrambling to come up with an alternative prom, seniors I spoke with, including one who was actually there during the prank, say the class got what they deserved. It's fair because it was our problem and it was our decision to do the water balloon fight. Sade Swain already bought her prom dress. We can't really be mad because we were pre warned. Davenport says the class of 2014 should learn from their mistakes. Listen to your principal. Scott Wegener, nine on your side, Withrow University High School. Uh,